Time now to reveal today's greatest Britain and Union jackass. Carol Malone, very quickly tonight, who is your GB nominee? As Liz Truss, um, I thought the budget was bold, it's brave, it's about stimulating growth, it's about unleashing enterprise and entrepreneurial spirit in Britain again. Uh, and yes, it's a big gamble, but it's not as big a gamble as sticking with the failed policies that we currently Sam have. Sam Dowler, your GB nominee. Rebecca Reeves for taking climate change seriously and speaking very eloquently about it and, and showing that the Labour Party actually know what they're doing. When it comes Belinda De Lucy, your nominee. Mine is honorary this week. It is Georgia Maloney, the new, uh, well, expected to be the next Italian PM right winger and sending the globalists and liberals into meltdown. <laughs> Fabulous. I'm going for Liz Truss because <laughs> you know what? If they're already writing the list, she's got to be doing something right. <laughs> At Union Jackass time, Carol Malone, I think yeah. it's on a similar note. Yeah, mine is those idiot Tories who, 20 days into Liz Truss's leadership, Ridiculous. are writing letters. And they want another leadership election. What's the matter with these people? They're going to destroy... Sam Dalla, your nominee. Um, Suella Braverman for posturing and blaming police uh, and crime on the wokeness, which is ridiculous. <laughs> and Belinda De Lucy. Mine has to be simply red. They're clearly simple and very <laughs> red champagne socialists. They have been tweeting nonsense about our government being far right and trying to take the government being forced out through strikes. Absolutely ridiculous. Simply red for me. Well, it's a double win for Carol Malone tonight because I've got to go for those apparent Tory letter writers. She's had 20 days. 12 of it was in official National Morning Ridiculous. Carol Malone, Sam Dalla, Belinda Lucy, thank you so much. I'm back again tomorrow night from 9pm.